Prolactinoma is a benign pituitary gland tumor, which produces the hormone prolactin in excess amounts. It is the most common type of hormone-secreting pituitary tumor. Based on the size, prolactinomas are classified as microprolactinoma, which is less than 10 mm in diameter, and macroprolactinoma, which is more than 10 mm in diameter. The exact cause of prolactinoma is poorly understood. However, several G mutations have been identified to be associated with prolactinomas, including pituitary tumor transforming gene. Most prolactinomas occur in isolation. They can also occur as a part of familial syndromes, such as multiple endocrine neoplasia. Signs and symptoms of prolactinomas occur due to hormonal effects, mainly prolactin, and due to space-occupying effects of the tumor. Symptoms due to hormonal effects include menstrual abnormalities such as absent menstruation, irregular, infrequent menstrual cycles, and delayed menarche if the tumor occurs before puberty. Females of reproductive age will also present with subfertility. These symptoms of prolactinoma are due to the reduced estrogen levels secondary to high circulating prolactin hormone levels. Females will also have galactorrhea, either spontaneous or expressive. Other features of hypogonadism in females include vaginal dryness, dyspareunia, or pain during intercourse, and reduced bone mineral density, which can lead to osteoporosis. In men, prolactinomas manifest as reduced sex drive, erectile dysfunction, and infertility. If the prolactinoma occurs before puberty, male child will have female body habitus with small testicles. If the prolactinoma is large enough to cause compression on the surrounding other hormone-secreting cells, secretion of other pituitary hormones will be reduced. Some of these hormones include TSH, growth hormone, and adrenocorticotrophic hormone. Symptoms due to space-occupying effects include headache and visual field defects due to compression on the optic nerve. Since majority of patients present with features of hormonal abnormalities, Hormone testing is the first-line investigation in evaluating prolactinoma. Some of these tests include prolactin levels in one or more occasions. Pregnancy test because pregnancy is the commonest cause for absent menstruation. Serum TSH levels. Testosterone levels in males. Cortisol and insulin-like growth factor levels. A brain MRI is indicated for the visualization of prolactinoma. This is an MRI of a pituitary gland prolactinoma. Finally, the treatment of prolactinoma can be divided into medical therapy and surgical therapy. Bromocryptine is the drug of choice in the medical management of prolactinoma. If bromocryptine fails to relieve the symptoms or it is not well tolerated by the patient, alternatives such as cabergoline and quinabolide can be given. Surgical treatment of prolactinoma is transphenoidal pituitary adenomectomy to remove the tumor.